In this video, we will see how the violations look like in the app and how can we know that we are close to a violation. Violations are based on the rules of the country in which you are driving. So before we talk about violations, it is worthwhile to discuss the rules. While driving in United States, you are subject to the rules of the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration. Under these rules, after 10 consecutive hours of off-duty, you can drive only within 14 hours driving window. The driving time limit is 11 hours. And after 8 consecutive hours of on-duty, driver has to take a break of at least 30 minutes. While driving in Canada, you are subject to the rules of Canadian Ministry of Transportation. Under these rules, you can also drive only within 14 hours driving window. The driving time limit is 13 hours. Once we are one hour away from a violation, at the bottom of the status screen, the upcoming violation starts to flash. The flashing information also indicates to us what kind of violation we are close to. The flash continues when we are already violating. The app will also buzz once we are already violating. The left circle in the status screen indicates how much time left until taking a break. It shows negative time and it flashes. That means that we violated the taking the break rule. If it was flashing but showing a positive time, that would have meant that we have less than one hour until taking a break. The middle circle in the status screen shows how much time left we have in the 14 hours driving window. Now it shows negative time and it flashes. That means that we violated the driving window rule. If it was flashing but showing a positive time, that would have meant that we have less than one hour until the end of the driving window. Just above the three circles, there is an indication of how much time left do we have until the end of the driving limit. It also indicates that we are violating the 11 hours driving limit rule. In the log section, we may find the same three violations. In the graph of our daily activity, we see three red triangular exclamation signs. If we click on the left triangle, it shows us 30 minutes break violation. We go back by clicking the back sign. If we click on the middle triangle, it shows us 11 hours driving violation.
The right triangle shows us 14 hours driving window violation. In the log section, the order of the violations is shown in the order as they appeared. That is to say that at first we violated the 30 minutes break rule, then we violated the 11 hours driving violation, and at the end we violated the 14 hours driving window.